In the last three to five years, we've identified a trend of independent RIAs looking to join other independent RIAs. So there's really this consolidation. Uh, it's usually occurring at that 200 million, 300 million and below. And the, the reason for that is, is really the heightened uh, compliance environment that we're in, the, the regulatory environment, the states have become more astringent, the SEC has become more astringent. And so with that, the business owners were finding themselves in a position that it is just very, very expensive. It was expensive to keep up with the times. Uh, they were full-time compliance officers and due diligence clerks and figuring out technology and technology due diligence and cybersecurity due diligence rather than serving their clients' needs. Um, so for that reason, we have seen just in this last three to five years, these smaller RIAs looking for plug and play options with larger RIAs that are over that 200 or 300 million mark so that they can just plug and play and do what they do best and do what they love most, which is working with and serving their clients. We've also seen a trend with custodians, uh, maybe not working with some of those startup RIAs. They want an established track record of compliance. They want to know that the independent RIA actually understands the rules and has that demonstrated track record before working you know, with those advisors. So major shift going on right now um, from you know, so many independent RIAs to a smaller number of larger independent RIAs. And that's a lot different than what we saw 10 to 15 years ago. The shift or the trend 10 to 15 years ago was everyone was moving and going independent RIA only. And now that new trend has just started in this last couple of years. So United Planners obviously has recognized this trend. And since our inception, really, certainly over the last two decades, we have been very friendly to the RIA space. We have allowed independent RIAs who have a demonstrated track record of proving that they know how to be compliant uh, to work with us as their broker dealers so they could be hybrids. But we've also been very open architecture for the IARs. And uh, in that instance, you know, they can be rep as portfolio manager, no basis points, fixed fee, less than $100 a year per account for their billing and reporting services, which is really kind of unheard of in the industry. And we're not trying to teach or force them to utilize proprietary products, platforms, solutions, or, you know, turnkey um, investment, you know, management solutions. They can still, within reason, be rep as portfolio manager to their clients and just plug and play into our ADV. One of the things that we've done that's very different that's actually coming in the next couple of months is allowing those advisors to be IAR only underneath our firm RIA. We're calling that Cairo. So that's our Cairo project. So historically, you've had to be a hybrid advisor registered registered on the broker dealer and the RIA side. And now you can be registered just as an IAR, plug into our ADV. We basically do all the background, you know, compliance components for you, uh, utilize our systems, our workflow, our relationships with the custodians, choose from multi custodian. So we've got all the big ones. We've even got some of the small ones. Um, so really providing that choice back to the advisors in a low cost environment that's just really good for clients. So we're really proud of what we've done and uh, this, this shift that's occurring and our ability to service those advisors and their clients.